I've been crossbow hunting for a number of years now. Really, really enjoy crossbow hunting. Um, just overall as a hunting tool, it's very, very effective to know that you're gonna be able to squeeze the trigger and most likely be able to get a lethal kill, a short blood trail, and that's exactly what we look for as hunters. Now, it's not just about choosing a crossbow that you're gonna be comfortable with and be able to shoot accurately. It's about choosing your whole system, your optic and your arrows, everything that goes into it, but then ultimately, what broadhead are you gonna put on those arrows that you shoot from your crossbow? I have shot a number of big game animals now with the Sever Robusto 2.0, specifically optimized for crossbows. There are a number of reasons why I love this broadhead other than the fact that everything I've shot with it hasn't gone very far, but when it comes to the overall design of this broadhead, it really was made specifically for crossbows. First of all, the blades are going to stay closed. Even if you're shooting out of a high-speed crossbow like the one I've got right here, it's a Siege RS 410 from 10 point. 410 stands for 410 feet per second. That's pretty dang fast. When this broadhead leaves this crossbow, the blades are gonna stay shut until they make contact with your target or with the animal that you're shooting at. That's a huge plus because you're gonna get more accuracy. You don't want the blades opening or shifting in flight because all that's gonna do is impede the aerodynamics and reduce the performance in terms of the flight of that broadhead. When the rubber meets the road, or when the stainless steel of this one-piece ferrule meets the animal, the blades are actually gonna be able to pivot to continue their course forward without just getting hung up on that object. So that is a huge, huge advantage for terminal performance. And that's what I've witnessed with the big game animals that I've shot. It's a wicked wound channel, and it just, it just works. The other thing is they've increased the size of the base of this ferrule, so it's gonna match up nicely to the arrows that you're shooting out of your crossbow. Just all around, whether you're a compound bow hunter or a crossbow hunter, these severed broadheads really seem to do the trick.